roller compacted concrete. Concrete is a very old construction material. Roller compacted concrete is a cost effective placement method of this traditional paving material. Shown here is the entrance to a construction demolition recycling center in Pennsylvania. This surface was placed about two years ago. It consists of eight inches of roller compacted concrete over a compacted aggregate stone base. The material contains no rebar or mesh of any kind. The traffic is mainly dump trucks in the 60 to 73,000 pound range when loaded. Daily traffic counts in the peak season are upwards of 300 trucks per day. This region of Pennsylvania is known for significant freeze-thaw cycles. The concrete area is exhibiting no cracks or failures. The placement process for roller compacted concrete begins with the sub-base preparation. In this example, the original surface was clean aggregate and earthen fill. The desired end result was a flat pad with a slight slope for drainage. Grade stakes were set accordingly. Recycled crushed concrete was imported to create the sub-base. This material was spread and graded. When the correct grade was achieved, the material was rolled to compact and smooth the surface of the area. No further preparation was necessary. This process could be varied somewhat based on the conditions of the site to be paved. Note that no forms have been positioned. The next step is to proceed directly to the placement of the concrete. This is done using a conventional paving machine just as you would use for placing asphalt on a roadway. The concrete blend is prepared in a standard ready-mix batch plant. The material is delivered to the paving machine with a dump truck which facilitates easy and continuous feeding of the paver. We have hauled the mixture without complications up to two hours from the ready mix plant. The paver operator sets up his machine to establish the width and depth of the paving. In this application, we are laying down a six inch depth of concrete paving material. The vibratory screed on the paver is controlling the depth and smoothing the surface as it proceeds. The low moisture cementaceous material will flow through the paver. The condition of the freshly laid concrete is very stable. Workers are able to walk on the surface directly behind the paver without deflecting the surface. This process can continue as long as necessary to complete the area to be paved. Multiple passes of the paver are simply laid down to touch one another. No rebar or other joining material is used. These seams will knit in the curing process. The next step in the process is to roll the fresh concrete with a smooth drum roller for final compaction and appearance. You can see that the roller does not compact the material very much, but there is compaction taking place and the roller is also improving the appearance of the final product. This also assists to knit any seams that may have been created. The edges of the paved area can be finished as desired depending upon the site requirements. In this case, aggregate material is filled in to create a shoulder against the edge of the paved area. The rolled surface is then sprayed with AquaCure. This liquid assists with the cure and sealing of the surface. Overall, the process requires one quarter the time of the equivalent area of conventional concrete pavement at one third the cost. The roller compacted concrete will be cured to full strength within seven days of placement. However, it is cured to a high level of strength within 24 hours, adequate to support light duty vehicles. The final step in the process is to place saw cuts in the surface if desired by the customer. Saw cuts are not required. There are no joints in roller compacted concrete. Full loading may be applied within three days. This helps to meet production schedules. The finished strength of the concrete will be in the 5500 to 6000 PSI range. The finished surface has a slightly rough appearance compared to the standard finish on a highway. This material is not intended for vehicles traveling at speed. It is ideal for areas that will experience low speed, heavy traffic. It is not subject to surface shear under the turning wheels of heavy vehicles. Shown here is a large parking area built for Baker Hughes to store heavy equipment used for gas well operations. Roller compacted concrete can be an effective paving material in applications that require the strength and characteristics of concrete 
without the burden of all the costs associated with traditional concrete paving methods. Contact us for consultation and pricing for your specific projects.